Last week, uh, Justice Michael Clark published his report into the tragic uh, circumstances surrounding the death of Sergeant uh, Mick Galvin at Ballyshannon Guard Station in County Donegal in May 2015. Sergeant Mick Galvin's death was a terrible tragedy, first and foremost for his wife, Colette, their three children, and the wider family circle, and indeed his, his guard of colleagues and the community in that particular region. Justice uh, Clark's report, uh, in my opinion, raises serious issues on how GSOC goes about its business and highlights shortcomings in how they go about their work. Justice Clark, I think it's important to say, says of Sergeant Galvin, and I quote, There is no doubt that he was an outstanding member of Angarda Sikana and an outstanding person. He also goes on to say, and I quote, Sergeant Mick Galvin was not involved in any wrongdoing. That is and was the clear outcome of the GSOC inquiry. A few questions arise for me from Justice Clark's report. First of all, was there a need at all for a criminal inquiry? Why was the file sent to the DPP when GSOC's own inquiry found nothing to report? I also note that members under investigation were not even informed that they were under criminal investigation. And tragically, in this case, Sergeant Mick Galvin was not informed of the outcome of that inquiry, that is, that he had no case to answer. I can only imagine the stress and worry and annoyance that this particular incident would have caused him and indeed his family. The ASGA has, as a result of that, this, the, this report, looking for an urgent meeting with GSOC in relation to items that spring from this report. And I would ask you, Leader, that you use your good office to facilitate this meeting. I fully appreciate that there will always be tensions between GSOC and Angardi. Both of them have a job to do, and both of them deserve the space and time to do that work. But this report clearly shows many shortcomings that need to be addressed, and I would ask perhaps that you would use your good offices, as I say, to help facilitate a meeting between the Gardaí and GSOC so everyone knows exactly where they stand and what's expected of them. For a